Hello everyone and welcome back to another Antco update video. Remember the meat ant queen I caught a while ago and then found out it was not a meat ant queen? Well, I've got some news about her. The first update I have is that she has larvae. Almost 3 months from capture she has 5 huge larvae and approximately 15 eggs. These larvae should pupate when spring rolls around in 2 weeks and I'm hoping to get the first generation of workers by October. This queen grows really slowly. If she was a meat ant queen, she would have more than 50 workers by now. My second update is that some of my friends think this queen is not an Eridomarmex queen at all. They reckon that she is an Natonkis queen, and if she was, it wouldn't make quite a bit of sense. Her growth is comparable to Natonkis, she was caught around the same time as Oma the Natonkis, and her brood size and shape is similar to that of Natonkis. Iridomarmex grow much faster than this and their eggs are spherical, while this queen's eggs are oval, just like the Tonkus eggs. So that's it for today's video. By the way, the vote is over, it is a tie. I will definitely be getting the Bullant Colony, and since the options of getting a meat ant queen and not getting a meat ant queen are tied, I will decide what I personally want. But anyways, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more.